Nashville. I mean, we're talking to people all over. We just talked to someone from Tulsa and Stillwater and Minnesota. People are here uh, from everywhere, including from all around the world. That's right. And it has been a day, months, if not years in the making. And park rangers and managers have spent quite a bit of time gearing up for the crowds of people. And the state wants to make sure everybody knows that cell phone service might be in short supply today. Every park's a little different on how it's laid out and how uh, highways and roads come into and out of the park. So we would encourage folks to pick up a paper map, um, to have a plan, um, to understand where they are and what an alternate route might be if they need to get somewhere quickly. Very good advice. Park officials say they hope today's visit eventually leads to return visits in the years to come. All right, so it is Monday morning. It is Eclipse Day, and I have to tell you, I am pleasantly surprised at the weather so far. We had kind of been gearing up and preparing ourselves for a cloudy day, and well, we have blue skies so far, and you know, we can only hope it stays that way. Yes, and it feels a lot better now, and the uh, square is getting really packed with a lot of people. So we'll be back uh, talking more about the Eclipse, but uh, now we're going to send it over to Phil. Phil. Yeah, Jeff, thanks.